hi everyone welcome back to the channel once again I do apologize for not making many videos this is just due to um, issues with Jennifer and her sleeping habits they're all out of control at the moment however here is my coloring supplies and book haul for the month of April I got a few books not too many and I got did get some supplies the first thing I got was this uh, pencil case um, I bought this one to put my Arteza pencils in so I'm slowly trying to get enough pencil cases for all of my pencils so yeah that's a nice one I like I actually like this pattern I've got similar ones for other ones but that's another one that's got its own case Little's had their alcohol markers in again and their sketch, their sketch pens. I've already got a few sets of these, but I got some more because I like them. And I've tried these water-based pens now, and they're really nice as well for patterns and things. So the water-based pens look like this. And you've got a brush on one end and a fine, what they call a fine nib on the other end. So there you go. But they, they're actually really, really nice. So I've got uh, a few sets of those. I just keep getting them every time they get them in stock because, yeah, I can't help myself. I got a 160 set of Ohuhu water-based markers, so they come in a big case. Let me just open it if I can. Oh, I'm not doing very well today. In one of those days, and it opens like this, and they actually come out, so like that. And you can read. So that's all the colours. You get lots of colours. It will completely lift out. So I'm not in my light, as you can see. I have swatched them. I really like them. There are some new colours. There's some more reds and yellows. They're the colours that tend to go the most. I'm still using my other set, but I do let Jennifer use them and the nibs are getting wrecked. That's why I bought those. And finally, my B&M Bargains actually had 60 Twin Marker sets in. So I did get them. Although I don't like... The yellows, the deep yellow, golden yellow and fresh yellow, they're kind of like more browns than yellow to be honest, but but they're okay, there's nothing wrong with them, I, I mean I am using them, um, but the plan is to use those for more for the pattern books rather than my more expensive books, but I don't want to use the water based ones. On to the books, I finally got Mythic World by Kirby Rosanis, obviously I got it from the works as you can see, again beautiful artwork in these, I've got pretty much all of his books apart from the combination ones and I've only coloured in two one of which is a whip that I still haven't finished but I want to I love this one this is one I want to do I like that one but I really do like them so that's Mythic World I got myself another Carla Magana book I got a Stardust Space Lust I really like the pictures in this I've already done one so you'll be seeing that in my completed pages very soon but I really like this so like I said I'm being quite good with the books and keeping them down I did get uh, the relax with art issue 91 you can't really see the pictures in here because they're full of lines but I do like them I mean, that's a lovely pattern so on these I might just have a go at doing the patterns on the eggs look at those eggs that is definitely going to be one that's done with the glitters <laughs> and then I got the Four Seasons Holiday Special Relax with Art so this is like obviously spring, summer, autumn and winter so you've got winter and uh, Christmas pages back very nice so you could do one each season or colour whatever you want whenever you want autumn, summer well that's nice <clears throat> spring That's a nice one. So yeah. So lots of good ones in there. Obviously, Come in Heaven, I always get. This month's special was Mermaids. I haven't coloured in it, but I do like these and I did the flip through. I really do want to, to colour this. Look at that, it's gorgeous. Mr. Cart Mirrors. We've got Selena Fennec, obviously. Like these cute ones, Ching Chow Quick. I like those. Very cute. I might do one of these today when I picked up Jennifer from school. I like, I like that book. I'm going to have to do something in that one. And then I got Kawaii Fairies from Ava Brown. Now I'm no longer on the launch team, which is uh, uh, fine because I'll only book, buy the books I want for now. Um, but I wanted this one because it's really cute. 
I'm sure I had a preview of this but it disappeared from my inbox, got deleted somehow. So yeah, I'm going to two sets of each so I can do one and leave one for Jennifer later. That's Kawaii Fairies. Only two more, like I said not many books this month. I got one called Fabulous 50s cover books. I like anything to do with the 50s as you know. And these are just nice simple ones that I can just colour as I feel. So Rockin' Sock Hop. Look, yes, sweet uh, mm, mm, mm. bits and pieces. I just like things like that. Daddy O. And doing a bit of rock and rolling. Nerd. The fabulous 50s. So, and rock and roll. I just like anything like this, so I thought I'd add it. And I got my first colour Questopia one. I got Witch Fantasy. I have started a picture in this, but I haven't finished it. I'll show you in a minute. Um, I like it, I like the pictures, but the colour chart is different for each picture, it's not the same one which is annoying, like with Such and Such Diva and the Jade Summer ones they're the same for every picture and every book, these aren't so I can't do a swatch chart of the thing, I actually have to have the full top swatch chart. Now the other thing I didn't like was I was using my water based markers in it and I was doing this one and the grey, the black seemed to run a bit, it doesn't look so bad now. But I, I can see it a little bit, so I don't know, maybe pencils in this one. I might I finish this one off and then I might try the next one, see what happens. But yeah, I like it. But that is all I bought in April. I'm trying to cut back on my colouring books and I will be cutting back on supplies. I just don't need anything. Uh, with books it's harder because so many come out. But if you want to see me colouring any of them, I will do a colouring chat soon. I do apologise and I'll explain everything that's been going on. Just let me know down in the comments below if you want to see me colouring one of these books or if you want a full flip through. And I'll see you very, very soon in the next video. Bye everybody.